Hey y'all, this is Ursula, your Harvey Container Gardener. Y'all, I'm out here and I'm not happy right now. Uh, some stuff going on with one of my plants. Um, I knew, you know, it's a possibility, but I was hoping that I would not um, have to deal with this. But uh, earlier today, I came out, I watered all of my plants. Everything was up, perky, pretty ready for the day uh, went ran some errands when I got back I noticed one of my uh, yellow straight neck squash plants all the leaves were just drooping down um, so I came out to do a little investigation and this is what I found so this is the plant leaves were all drooping down it, it didn't need any water there was water that I gave it this morning um, and I watered it again when I got home thinking maybe it needed some more water but I did a little dissection y'all and this is what I found so the um, the squash bug right here was on one of my other plants um, so I guess she was laying eggs on the zucchini because she already didn't laid eggs on this uh, yellow neck squash. So I dissected the squash and this is what I found in here. So I did spray it with neem oil. I'm going to put it here so y'all can see it. I did spray it with neem oil. Well, he done fell down now, but he did. But I wanted to go all the way through and see what I can see. So I don't see anything else other than that little bug. I think that was it that was in here that did all of this damage, y'all. Killed my yellow neck squash plant. So she got sprayed with neem oil and well, yeah, he got sprayed with neem oil. So, what I've been doing, y'all, I've been checking my other plants. This is my other uh, straight neck squash. As you can see, it has a squash on it. It's, it's doing well. The other little one in the back, not, I don't think it's going to make it. It's not brown, but it didn't get big like the first one. And they came on at the same time. So, But I thank God for this one. So, I'm going to be taking that one off pretty soon. And then over here, I have my two zucchini plants. Now this zucchini plant, I didn't see anything on it. I didn't see any holes. I didn't see anything to be concerned about. This one, however, this is the plant that the uh, squash vine borer was on. Um, I guess she was over there laying some more eggs on this one since she already got one but I caught her and I sprayed her. So uh, I do have a hole at the bottom of this one right here. I can feel it, it's kind of soft. So I did spray some neem oil in it. So hopefully if there was something that is in there, got in there, hopefully I killed it. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna have to keep an eye on it. So I just wanted to kind of give you guys a heads up about these, um, these bugs and these squash vine borers that um, kill your plants like I said I looked at it this morning it was up perky healthy happy and by this afternoon all of the leaves were lying down so um, I don't think I'm gonna be planting any more uh, straight neck squash this year um, I'm gonna just try to keep what I have and hopefully um, I can make it through the year, the rest of the, uh, the spring season, um, and get some zucchini and some squash off of the three plants that I have left. So uh, you guys just keep a watchful eye out if y'all are growing squash or zucchini. Um, I try to keep my leaves down so I can see what's going on in my plants. Um, but even with that, I, I didn't catch that wasn't out here in time enough to do anything about it but i think what i might do is i might start covering them um when i'm not out here to kind of 
give it a little protection. I don't know what else to do, y'all. All right, y'all. Just be safe. Keep an eye out on your plants. And don't let them ruin your uh, spring growing season. All right, yeah. I, I'm just a little disappointed, y'all, but I'm going to be okay because I'm blessed. I still have more that I can um, I can provide, bring food inside, y'all. So a little bummed, but, you know, it didn't knock me completely out. So, all right, guys, I, I'm going to get back to what I'm doing. I'm going to be checking, making sure everything is okay. And I will keep a watchful eye out on that first one because if y'all can see, that's two nice sized zucchinis that's trying to grow but that's the plant that has the uh soft hole at the bottom y'all so all right y'all i'm about to get uh back to work i just wanted to give you guys an update on what was going on back here in the garden keep an eye out on your plants watch your plants if you see something going on do something about it all right y'all later